What is up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Jeff Benjamin with I Download Blog. We're talking about Andrios today. This is a jailbreak tweak that brings an Android inspired experience to iOS. So you'll find all sorts of Android inspired components like this switch widget or an action bar or an alternate notification center, etc. Here is the search widget that comes with Andrios. And as you can see there, it works just as you would expect. You just tap in the box and start typing and then tap go, and then you can submit your search. So easy, just like that. But it doesn't stop there. You can also rearrange the browser window that pops up. Let me show you this right here. So I'm gonna search for, um, how about CNN? Let's see, CNN, there we go. And there is the window. I can drag the edges, drag the corners, move this all around however I want it on my home screen, just like that. And you have options below for opening in Safari, going back, forward, etc. It's really cool. Okay, so now let's talk about the mini player widget. So I'm playing a song right here in the music app, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just invoke the mini player using my activator gesture that I set up. Double tap of the status bar, and there is the mini player. Of course, I can play pause, go back, forward, music. I can move that widget around however I want to. I can double tap it to hide it on the side, double tap it again to reveal it. I can now also tap and hold to center it, just like that. And you can have multiple widgets displaying at once courtesy of Andrio. So you see I have the switches widget, have the mini player widget, I also have the search widget up there. You can have all those running at the same time if you want to. Now another thing you'll find with Andrios is the alternate notification center and this really looks like Android. If you've used Android before, this will definitely look familiar to you. Uh, the alternate notification center brings all sorts of toggles and switches there, it brings shortcuts to the settings app, among other features that we'll talk about in a second. But before that, let's talk about the volume slider. You'll notice a different volume HUD with Andrios installed. You see that at the top there? So you get the volume HUD that you can actually interact with right at the top of the interface, which is really nice. You can't do that with stock iOS. Now back to the alternate notification center, you can customize this to your liking. Uh, you can also have notifications that are very much Android-like. There's also an action bar. So you know the little buttons at the bottom of pretty much every Android phone, the back home buttons, things like that. Well, you can actually access those courtesy of Andrios. So I've assigned an activator gesture, which is a triple press of the home button, and watch this. See that? That is your action bar. Now I find that the action bar doesn't really work that well, at least on my iPod Touch. Uh, some of the buttons disappear from time to time, and it's not always responsive. So for that reason, I really just don't use it. Plus, I don't like the idea of having on-screen buttons anyway to do things that we can do normally with iOS. Now let's go back and talk about the alternate notification center. So you see I have received some notifications here. Uh, there's two test messages that I've sent. And the nice thing about this is you can swipe to have a reply or to close out the message, but you can also close out all messages at once by tapping the button in the bottom right hand corner. Same thing goes for the lock screen as well. If you double tap on a message, it will clear all messages in one fell swoop. Now you'll also notice this really cool power down menu, which gives you more options than you would normally have with stock iOS. You have reboot, respring, power off, airplane mode, you have mute, vibration, and volume options, and you even have the little slider at the top to adjust your volume. So ladies and gentlemen, this is Andrios, a $3.99 jailbreak tweak that will be available on the Big Boss repo. It brings tons of Android inspired options to iOS. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.